morning, friends. Happy Friday. It has been a crazy, crazy week. We started off Monday with us driving home from Disney. And then we got home, you know, relaxed, did laundry, whatever the case may be. And then Tuesday, I went to work, but I left work at like three o'clock because I was like super sick to my stomach, like keeled over super sick to my stomach. By the time I left work at three o'clock, I mean, I left out of there at three o'clock. And by the time I got home, which was like five minutes down the road, I literally this close to like throwing up in the garbage can in the garage because I was that sick when I was driving home. And of course I had like you know, school bus traffic and everything. I'm going, no, I gotta get home. So yeah, needless to say, I was sick. Um, I called off Wednesday and I called off Thursday. So super sick to my stomach. And then um, started feeling so much better yesterday, midday. And um, then last night in bed, I was like starving to death. I think because ugh, my body had just like, Ugh, got rid of everything and then I started getting my appetite back where I was getting hungry but I didn't eat last night I just went to bed drank a ton of water and then this morning I woke up and had breakfast so um I'm feeling a lot better still feeling a little drained but um other than that I'm feeling so much better um <clears throat> I did not have to call off today because I have Fridays off my new schedule <clears throat> actually starts next week but because I've been like here at the other office or whatever, then, you know, I could either work all day Thursday or work half day Thursday, half day Friday, whatever the case may be. But since I just took all day yesterday, I'm just, today is my day off. I'm not, and I have to call in. I'm just taking the day. Um, I just don't have to work on Fridays. So next week though, I start my new schedule at work. Um, a whole different office, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, 8.30 to 5.30, Thursday, 8.30 to 3.30, and then I have Fridays off. So I was a little upset about the whole 5.30 thing, and then I'm thinking, duh, Ange, why be upset about 5.30 uh, for three nights? I get two days off, at three, one day off at 3.30, and one day totally off. So <clears throat> I'm fine. I am, I'm, I'm happy about it. I'm just finally happy to be able to go into an office and... Um, just get back to my normal normal routine. The drive is gonna suck because it's about 30 minutes, but um, I'm fine regardless. I'm just happy to be put back in an office where I am being utilized. So anyway, what is on my plan for today? Today, I plan on um, putting all of the laundry away that I have been trying to get done for the past couple of days. Um, because while I was at home sick, I have been trying to get, catch up on some laundry. So I'm going to be putting that away. I have folded it and stuff, but I just have to like hang it up and put it away. And then um, <clears throat> this weekend, I'll be changing sheets on the bed, which will probably be Sunday morning. And then um, today I'm going to go over to the, uh, my office that I've been at for the past couple of months and get all of my belongings and then put them in my car because that way I can take them with me Monday morning at my new office. And then I'm going to meet Brian for lunch today. We're going to go have sushi and um, I have to film a couple of videos today and get those up and edited or edited and up. And then, yeah, if you guys have been watching my Disney vlogs, Disney vlogs are up. I'm going to have Disney vlogs up until like two weeks from now. Um, I don't want to bombard you guys every day with like Disney vlogs. So I'm trying to do them like every other day. And then little videos that I've been doing um, in between them, like my fashion show and uh, my Disney haul and probably my monthly favorites and my monthly empties. Um, those are the two that I have to do today. My monthly empties and my monthly favorites. Those are the two that I have to do today and get those up. So in between the Disney videos, I'm going to be, you know, pushing those ones in there. So I hope you guys are enjoying everything. And I know you guys enjoy the fashion show. I, I hear a lot of great compliments on that. Thank you so much. And I definitely plan on doing another one. I... This close to doing a bathing suit one. Oh, that's so scary. Um, that's like really exposing things. But, you know, this is about um, body confidence. And I'm 43 years old. I am a big girl. Um, I've gained my, some of my weight back, which I'm going to start getting back on track with all that now that I'm going to have a regular schedule again. 
And then, um, but I really want to share with you guys the bathing suits and stuff that I wear because I don't wear bikinis and I don't wear like one pieces. I do wear bikinis. So leave me a comment below and let me know if that is something that you guys would be interested in and seeing um, a bathing suit fashion show from me. Ooh, it's a little scary, but... <sighs> I think I can do it. I think I can manage to do it. Just let me know what you guys think. Leave me a comment below and I will check back in with you guys later. I got some stuff to do around here, so bye for now. Hello, friends. I'm on my way to my office where I have been for the past couple of months to pick up all of my belongings um, because I'm gonna be taking those with me to my new office on Monday morning. So that is what I'm doing. And it looks a little dark. It's because it's like the lighting is really bad. But anyway, it's supposed to be a high of like 91 today. Hello, summertime. So I have like on a sleeveless shirt, which oof, not a big fan of wearing sleeveless because like my arms are ginormous. Yeah, and I have like, you know, those wings that flap in the wind, ladies, if you know what I'm talking about. Yes, we got some wings. Um, but I'm wearing a sleeveless shirt, and I'm wearing a pair of cute shorts that I got at Torrid. Um, I might do another fashion show and show you guys like this ensemble put together. I might do like a fashion Friday since I'm gonna have like Fridays off. I don't know. I'm trying to think of some different things that I can do um, instead of doing all the same things over and over again. I'm trying to think of some new material. Let's just let's just go there. I'm trying to think of some new material to share with y'all. So yeah, let me know what you guys think of this like Fashion Friday. I mean, I think basically what it would be is I would be just, you know, wearing maybe a new outfit or putting something together that's new. Um, even if it's like the same shirt but a different pair of shorts or the same shorts different pair of shirt type of thing or just whatever the crap outfit I'm wearing that day that's let's just call it that you know um so yeah that is what I'm doing so I will check back in with you guys in a little bit I'm gonna load up my car with all of my stuff and then um probably just waste some time because oh wait it's 11 30 or it's 11 15 holy shnikes okay so I am running a little behind actually so I just got to grab my stuff and go because I'm meeting Brian or I'm picking him up at 1245 at his office um, because we're going for sushi today and um, Brandy which is his secretary slash my friend um, she's going with us as well so let's go have some sushi folks hello friends we just finished lunch. It was a very, very nice. It was so good. Oh my God. I've been craving that sushi ever since we went a couple of weeks ago. Um, but anyway, it's Sushi Avenue in Snellville, Georgia. And um, if you guys absolutely love sushi, I know like you guys, I'm just saying like in general, if anybody from like Georgia, Snellville area is watching, um, the Sushi Avenue is so good. Oh my God delicious the best sushi I've had in this area and that's no la um, and I wanted to share with you guys like on film or whatever what we ate but um, Brian's the secretary was there Brandy was there our friend was there and um, so it was just kind of like you know hard to pull off the camera and stuff when you got other people there that just kind of like just don't get it or whatever so anywho um, I'm at the bank now but like seriously why is this person taking so long Oh God, yeah. hold on a minute. Um, my beautician used this on me a couple of weeks ago when I went and had... So this is what I'm doing right now. I am editing three of my videos that I did today. Um, you guys can be looking forward to seeing those next week. I'm watching 90210 on Hulu because that is like everything. I love 90210. Love watching this show. It's so like 90s and it like brings me back to like back when I was in the 90s guys and I'm just sitting here doing that and watching um, watching TV and editing videos and I was gonna stop off at my PO box today but completely forgot because I came home like the wrong way 
So I'm going to have to go and do that sometime or another. But, um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to throw that out, you guys, that I, I have a P.O. box. Don't forget about that. Uh, if you guys want to send me something, please do. I totally want to hear from you guys. And then uh, I will do a mail vlog if I get enough mail or whatever and share it um, with you guys as well on a video. So please don't forget that I have a P.O. box. I want to hear from you guys. Let me hear from you. I want to hear from you. <laughs> Bye, guys. gloves when you sign up so there's my name I have to put my name on my gloves so they're mine to keep forever and ever and ever and ever I think Brian only has like 10 classes or he has seven classes left and I just signed up and I have 10 so hopefully he'll sign up for a little bit more and we can continue to do it maybe they'll give us a deal like couples signing up or something so um, our neighbor Tiffany is doing it, Brian's um, secretary and my friend Brandy, the one that we had lunch with today, she's doing it. We have another from Michelle who signed up and did it. So we're all like doing it, doing it, doing it well, doing it and doing it and doing it well. We're excited about it though. I'm excited about it. So um, I asked too if I'm allowed to film in there because I'd like to film just a few things just to share, you know, what it is and show you guys what I'm doing. So, uh, yeah, I have to wait and ask permission first from the owner, which I don't think that they're going to have a problem with it. It does nothing but promote their kickboxing class. So, um, anyway, so I'm headed home right now. Brian's a little bit behind me, and I will check back in with you guys later. Bye. Good morning, friends. Happy Saturday. It wouldn't be a regular Saturday weekend without a trip to Lowe's. So that's where we are headed right now. We've already done our grocery shopping for the morning, and now we are headed to Lowe's to get some more mulch. We got to get some furnace filters, and I have an idea. Yeah, let's go get some bulbs. <laughs> we have to go get bulbs. We're about out. So let's take a trip to Lowe's. Did you say you have to go inside there with me? Inside Lowe's? Yeah, I do. Oh, okay. If you would, take a picture of that so when we get up there, okay. um, we don't have to. Yeah. I can just type in the number. I can. put this on my patio like a pretty patio I actually need one of these I need one of these in the back oh that's a foam oh that's weird hmm I thought that was like a little rug I guess I was wrong oh there you go Brian Oh, I thought he was coming over here to, to help you or to tell you yeah, no. that they'll load okay. it. Believe me, okay. Uh huh. All of the pretty flowers at Lowe's.
quite the long hose. Yeah, I think on this one here, I'm only going to get one. I was going to get two, but I think I can cut, take one and just cut it in half. Oh, yeah. <coughs> and it'll be exactly what I need. Um, so I need this bulb. And I don't see it anywhere yet. Looking for the bulbs. There's the big fat ones. I need a little tiny one. Is that them? It is. Ooh, that's 60 watts. Um, 40 would probably work, but so that means I'd have to push them all out in the kitchen. So that's the ones I'm going to get right there. And then I need big fat ones. I'm going to get these ones too because I need some for over my sink. So I'm going to get those ones and then I'm going to get another one. So yeah, that way I have that many. Okay. Found them. Yay. My phone is blowing up. <laughs> Just send it to you, just Ray. Ray, Rich, Tiffany, Sandy. No, you <laughs> No. Why? I don't know. I forget. So, we are home, and here is the plan for today. I'm going to be cleaning off this patio. I'm going to be cleaning off my patio furniture and getting all of our chairs and stuff down from the carport, which is over there where all the stairs are at. That leads upstairs. Oops, I just dropped the broom. Anyway, so I'm going to sweep off this patio, and while I'm going to rinse it off and then I'm going to wipe down my table and get all of my lawn furniture out. So let's do this folks. Let's get the patio cleaned off and get everything all prettied up for summertime. So here is my lunch today. I'm having some baby spinach with some of my mozzarella balls and tomatoes. And I have some chickpeas on there with my new balsamic glaze vinaigrette. Absolutely love it. A little bit of salt and pepper. And yum yum. Let's eat. Brian is having sushi. You're hiding? Brian's having sushi. How is it, Brian? Good. Very good. So I wanted to give you guys a quick little patio update. We came in and had some lunch which I just shared that with you guys. But Brian brought all of our patio furniture down and now I just have to put it around the table. But I cleaned up the patio the best that I could. And we still have like less of stains on there, but whatever, I can't help all that. But anyway, so this is the patio. This is the little table. I've cleaned this completely off, used some Dawn um, kitchen detergent to wipe it all down, sprayed it down, got it all taken care of, and then Brian brought all the furniture down. So now I just have to put all the furniture around it. I'm not gonna get out the cushions yet. This is where I keep all of our cushions. Oh, we have frogs everywhere. Um, I'm not gonna get out my cushions because it's supposed to rain, but when I know it's gonna be like days without rain, then I'll just get my cushions out and put those out. But I'm excited to get this started, so I'm gonna go ahead and start putting all of my furniture around. And Brian has been working on some of the drainage stuff for the front, and he put in new piping right here, right there, and it comes right out here, and it's just supposed to sprout out of this little green lid because it keeps flooding all of our landscaping and making a big huge mess so we're trying to keep that from making a mess so he added the drainage there all my flowers are blooming everything's looking really really good our landscaping is still kind of a mess though we want to take out all the rock that's all the way around it but, well my flowers right there are blooming everything looks so good Oh, that's nice. <laughs> nice. Nice. Anyway, 
Got all my flowers and my baskets up here. I haven't shown you guys anything since Brian's parents were here. We've been so busy. But these are all filled up. Everything looks so good. Got all this stuff done. He has already shut the garage door. Has shut me out. Anyway, this is I still have to put a flower right there. And I don't think he planted this other thing that I had in my pot. Oh no. Let's go see. Tonight we're gonna be hanging out in that house down there. Here's my purple flowers here. Brian put the owl here because the birdies are nesting in our pillars and in my wreath up there. So, but anyway, yeah, no, he didn't plant that. So that has to be put in a, in the ground. We haven't done that yet. But anyway, this is just my little thingy there. It's kind of tacky, but I'll have to figure something out. I wanted to put like a wreath there. I haven't figured that out yet though. I haven't bought one, but anyway. So I'm gonna go in and finish cleaning up in the house and getting some stuff done in there. It's nice and cool in here. Whew. Super, super nice. I think he is in the shower. Whew. I'm watching Some Kind of Wonderful. I love that movie. Have you guys ever watched that movie? Some Kind of Wonderful. Love it. Love it. All right, time for me to get some more stuff done around the house. Check back in with you guys later. Hello, Bye. friends. Happy Saturday evening. We are headed over to a friend's house this evening to hang out, play some games, a few snacks. And I'm just wearing this like cute little black shirt that I got at Old Navy, the really loose fitting one. I did a haul on it a couple weeks ago. I'll put a link up there if you guys missed it. And then I just have a white skirt on with it. And then I'm just gonna wear my black sandals with it as well. I think I'm probably also gonna wear um, a black sweater. Oops, I thought I had it sitting there, but I don't. I'm also gonna wear um, a cute, just like a little black sweater because um, their basement can get a little chilly because um, that's where the their pub and stuff is at. So, oh no, I feel like I have a booger. Okay, boogies. Anyway, um, so yeah, hopefully it's going to be a nice fun evening. Not hopefully, it usually is. Um, I'm out for playing some games and hanging out and having fun and relaxing and chilling with our friends and neighbors. Um, and then tomorrow it's supposed to rain, although we are supposed to go next door for a volleyball and cookout and all that good stuff. But I have so much stuff that I have to do still here at the house, like finish up my laundry and hang all that stuff up because I kind of worked outside a lot today. Um, and then I put together our chicken kebabs and stuff for lunch, for dinner, lunch today, and then for tomorrow as well. So um, anyway, I'll check back in with you guys later. And if you guys want to hang out with me later on, come on with us to the pub. You can. If not, I'll see you next time. Supercharged it with anal beads. <laughs> <laughs> anal beads. <laughs> Forget everything you know about. <laughs> oh, no. Good morning, friends. Happy gloomy day, rainy Sunday. That's what today is, which we knew it was going to be. So I'm thinking that volleyball and cooking out is off today, which is good because I have a lot of things I want to get done here at the house. So I probably wasn't going to play volleyball, maybe one game today if we did play. But <clears throat> anyway, I have a lot of things I got to get done around the house. If you can hear the water running, I'm about ready to do or put the dishes in the dishwasher. But before I do, I wanted to show you guys, if you guys watched my grocery haul, I don't know, a couple of weeks ago, I don't remember which one this one was on. But um, in a grocery haul, I had showed you guys that we had bought this um, pancake mix, which is made out of oatmeal. And we finally used it this morning. And honestly, it was like the best pancake mix besides like original regular pancake mix. This was pretty darn good. And we were definitely very happy with it because it's healthier for you and it's made out of oatmeal. So if you guys are um, ever interested in it, I got it at my local Kroger. And again, it's just a private collection and it's buttermilk oatmeal pancake mix and it was super good. And it's just um, three ingredients. It's just one cup of the oatmeal and it's 34 cup of milk and one egg. And then you just whip it all together and put it on your griddle like a normal pancake. And like I said, it tasted fantastic. So if you guys are ever interested in a healthier alternative for pancakes, I think the oatmeal weight is the way to go. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and get started on cleaning my kitchen this morning, and then I'm gonna go change sheets on my bed, make up my bed, and then start getting some clothes put away. And then um, I start my new office tomorrow, so I gotta prepare myself mentally for my new office, get my clothes out that I'm gonna wear for that. Yeah, so it's a busy day. Stick around. So the volleyball game and cookout for next door has been canceled due to thunderstorms and rain that we have been getting today, which I kind of knew that was going to happen. Oh, well, no big deal. At least I've been getting a lot of my stuff done. We did run to Publix really quick to pick up subs because Brian was wanting a sub for lunch today. So we went and picked up a, uh, excuse me, a Publix sub, which those are like absolutely fantastic. Those are delicious, delicious subs. And then um, came back, started talking to my oldest son um, via text, of course, and we're just trying to figure things out for Memorial Day weekend. Um, yay. And then, um, let's see, uh, hmm, what else? I've been folding up clothes, putting clothes away. I did change the sheets on my bed, so I did all that. Check that off my list. It's 1.42, so it's about quarter to two right now, and... I'm still just cleaning, so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here because I don't know, we're not doing anything else that's really exciting for the rest of the day. Um, so thank you guys so much for hanging out with me this weekend. Totally appreciate it. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave me a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys next weekend. Bye!